What's going on guys? TS Gameplay here. Today I've got part of a domination that I dropped into. I don't know what my final score was on this, but I think I got a few caps. Um, I really don't care as far as PC gameplay at this point for what I'm uploading. I will get another Xbox here in the near future, probably before uh, Black Ops 2 comes out. Still on the fence as far as learning the PC controls. Not really learning them, but more or less making the transition from, you know, a traditional controller. Um, I want to talk a little bit today about a topic that a lot of people seem overly concerned about as far as people that make YouTube videos. And that is the quality of the video that you upload. Um, I started in the beginning with a, I think it was a $50 little capture card from Best Buy deal. You can go back and look at some of my first videos. I mean, the quality wasn't excellent. It wasn't great. It it was really subpar. And, you know, that really bothered me for a long time. Um, probably for the first year, I had really bad quality in my videos. And it just, it, it really pissed me off. I wanted my quality to be good. You know, it was like something that really, really bothered me. So then I went out and I got an HD PVR. And, you know, they're pretty much... At the, you know, for at the time, I made the quality as good as it could get. And, you know, since having sold my Xbox and my HD PVR since then, I've thought a lot more about, as far as getting, getting back into commentating, about how much I care about the quality of my videos. And I've come to realize that I really don't care at all. Um, it's not really important, basically, is what I'm saying. How good your video looks has nothing to do. It's about the content, and then it's about what you got to say. Um, it really doesn't matter. You know, all the first people I watched that inspired me to do this, as far as, like, you know, Taves, Hutch, c Nanners, they could have had horrible quality. They could have made it, it could have been to where they were, you know, like, recording the game with a camcorder on their TV, talking in the background. You know, and that, it wouldn't have mattered because of, you know, their personalities and the way they took off on YouTube. You know, the quality, it, w it wouldn't have been an issue for them. And it really shouldn't be for anybody else. So, you know, if you are, I don't know, just starting YouTube or you've been doing it for a while and you know, your video quality isn't, you know, absolutely amazing, like 1080p, flawless, looks incredible, the, the best it could be, don't worry about it. Um... Worry more about, you know, the content that you're going to provide to your channel. Worry more about coming up with commentaries as far as different things to talk about. I know that's, number, you know, one of the number one issues that, you know, people that are just starting out have is coming up with issues, uh, you know, series, what have you, different things to talk about. And, you know, those are the things that you should really focus on. Um, not so much the quality of the video. But the quality of the content that you're bringing, um, because that's what matters most. That's what's going to earn you the most attention. That's that's what that's how you're going to get subscribers. You know, it's it's quite irrelevant how your videos look. Um, you shouldn't stress about that. You know, most people want a HD PVR, this that. It's it's really not that big a deal if you don't have one. Um, you know, I just thought I'd make a little video about it. I feel that people. They just care way too much. YouTube quality video, you know, the quality of the videos, it couldn't matter less. It's absolutely irrelevant. Doesn't matter at all. So, that's just my opinion on that. But this is wrapping up here, guys. I'll have another video for you up in the next couple days. As always, I hope you enjoyed. Have a nice day.